welcome to Edinburgh Watch Company. My name is Jonathan and on today's video I've got an absolutely cracking watch for you. Here we have the Audemars Piquet Code 1159. It is just awesome. Now you can see more about this watch by visiting our website at edinburghwatchcompany.co.uk. There you'll find we've got some photographs, technical specification and pricing, but of course if there's anything else you'd like to know then please just give me a call. On that topic of pricing, go and have a look at the price because we have got an absolutely massive saving off this watch. Now, this is the AP Code 1159. In the words of AP, classic by nature, unconventional by design. It says it all. This is not your Royal Oak. It's not your offshore. It is an absolutely stunning dress watch and we're absolutely delighted to be given the opportunity to share this watch with you. This particular watch was bought brand new in 2019, the year when this watch was launched. It is finished in 18 karat rose gold, mounted on an alligator leather strap, and it is the most striking watch. It's a chronograph, it's automatic, it has a flyback function, it's kind of got everything you need, and of course that date window as well. We'll get a closer look at it in a minute. Now, I know my Rolexes quite well, we see them every day. We don't see these watches very often. In fact, you can't even buy these watches in the typical Audemars Piquet store. They're only available through boutiques, so it's not one you're gonna see on the high street at all. And they're pretty rare. But it's a knockout, it's an absolutely gorgeous watch. But then having said that, I'm very biased to anything in rose gold and on a leather strap. But I do like my chronograph as well. In fact, proof of the pudding, I'm actually wearing a, a chronograph today, albeit this one's in platinum. It's a lovely Zenith L Premiere. But yeah, I love that sort of look and feel of the, of the rose gold. Now, before shooting this video today, I looked and I read all about the AP by means. I looked on the website and we looked at the dome of the glass and I looked at the movement and I thought, God, how can I remember all of that? And I really, really admire actors now that can spend days and weeks actually learning a script, but I'm really sorry, I can't do that. So I'm gonna to have to point you back to Audemars PK's site where you can read all about the, the technical aspects of this watch, but it's absolutely full of great uh, features and benefits for you to enjoy in this watch. What you need to know is this watch is absolutely stunning. It comes complete with all its original box and papers. It's in as new condition and it's got thousands and thousands of pounds off it. Hopefully that's enough to excite you and go and have a look at it. So I'll go and let's have a slightly closer look at the watch just now. We can see a little bit more of this watch in detail. So here we are, just look at that. Um, case size is about 41 millimeters, so I think it's just a good size. I think for this style of watch, that's perhaps big enough. I know when you get to like the, the sportier watches, like the, the, the Royal Oaks and the Kronos, the Kronos, the Offshores, they're bigger, but I think this is just about right for a watch that can be worn really for anything, really. But the dial itself, it's just lovely with the, the sub-dials in black with a very, very thin circle um, as a perimeter. That date window down here between four and five o'clock. But that's just the dial itself. And again, the, the, uh, when I was reading about it, the, the way that the Audemars Piquet is, is sort of shown across the dial there, um, that's actually almost like 3D technology, the way they've built up layers of gold to get that, that look like it's actually been mounted on the dial. It, it's really quite special. You can see here you have the tachymeter going around the perimeter of the, the dial too. But then just look at the side. Just look at that design, it's absolutely gorgeous. Satinized, running across the center there in the middle of the case, and then here, these two frames that go around it there, that's all in um, satinized there. We can see the screws there either side of the lugs there. It really is an absolute masterpiece. And it's not your traditional AP, so it is something a bit different, but you know, I really admire them for bringing something out as a complement to their range. Look at that crown there, you can see with the, the AP logo on it. And the way that you have the pushers there, the rectangular pushers, is just beautifully designed to, to fit in with the look of the watch there. And then on the back, it gets better, look at that. Beautiful case back there. Perimeter of gold, Audemars Piquet engraved on it there. And then you can see the gold rotor here and the most gorgeous movement there. It really is quite something. We'll do some macro of this as well so you can appreciate that. And then here, mounted on the alligator strap, a sort of matte alligator design there. 
and then this beautiful tang buckle there, satinized 18 karat gold, very traditional look to it there. But even the back of the strap, it's, it's like an like alligator design on the back as well. It really is lovely with the Audemars Piquet writing on it there. So let me try and show you what this is like on the wrist. Uh, my wrist is about an eight inch wrist, so it's a lovely size for me. And it's a very, very comfortable watch to wear. And there we have it. So you can see that just gives you a sort of perspective of, of what it's like. I'll just hold it up just slightly for the camera there as well. This sort of helps just to give you that perspective of thickness on the wrist. So of course, being an automatic, including that, that sort of flyback function, it's going to be slightly thicker than a, than a non-chronograph watch, but it's not too big. And I think it just looks so classy there with the rose gold and the alligator combination. I think I do like a deployant clasp, um, but I think when you have the tang buckle like this, it's, it is a little bit flatter on the wrist. It's very, very comfortable. And I think it just really works very, very well. So I think it's a cracker. And um, I think if you're looking for a luxury watch, maybe something to, I don't know, celebrate a promotion, maybe an anniversary, maybe a birthday gift, or maybe just a treat to yourself, then I think this would be something, you know, really quite spectacular. So there we are. That brings us to the end of today's video. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch this. Um, as I say, please go and jump on the website to find out more. If you love your watches, then please, why not subscribe to our YouTube channel? If you're watching us on YouTube today, you can just click on there and then you'll be notified of all our latest videos. We've shot hundreds of videos of various watches and we'll have lots more coming along soon. If you follow us on Instagram or Facebook, then you'll see all of our watches too. And if you don't follow us, then please go and come and join the Edinburgh Watch Company community. Thanks for watching today. Take care. Bye-bye.